What's good with y'all boys? I know some of y'all need y'all's badges grinded, so make sure you check out the most legit badge grinding service in the community and just let them know Wavy sent you, man. All their links are down below in the description. Let's get right into this banger. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Wavy, and we're back with another video. Now, our, I already recorded this video one time. Got the whole video done. As soon as I got the video done, all the files corrupted, bro. Like, I was about to say, I was like, GG, bro. I wasn't even going to make this video again. That is the most frustrating thing in the world. But that's not what y'all are here for. Progression. First things first. Now, y'all know this build could not get pro dribble moves at first. But now, as y'all can see, I got an 83 ball control. Y'all see the defense. Great defense. Uh, 85 three-pointer. I'm telling y'all, when I make a build, for now on, I want an 85 three-pointer or higher. Now, 85 three-pointer is crucial in this game. I don't know. It's like once you get to 85, it's so much easier to green. 88 midi, 71 job and dunk, 80 close shot. Now, my layup, I left it down because I only take layups if they're wide open. Y'all already know this. But y'all see, great all-around build. Now, I'm going to go straight into my badges. These are my badges. I'm not going to explain it too much. Just make sure y'all have these badges on. They'll change your whole shooting ability. Now, this is what I'm running for playmaking. And then for defense, that's what I got on because, you know, I be getting hit by them screens. But let's hop right into these animations. I'm going to go ahead and show you all my dribble moves for this build. Just because y'all been showing some, y'all been showing mad love to the streams, to the videos, everything. So this is what y'all get right here. Make sure y'all equip these, bro. I'm telling y'all, these dribble moves are, they're really nice, bro. They're really nice. I like these way better than my other ones. And then... This is what I use as my uh, jump shot emote. I use either statue or home run. These didn't feel as good, but these two are like the best in my opinion. But that's all I got for y'all. I've hit 99 on my sharp shooting facilitator. Let's get straight into the gameplay. Now, this gameplay is not the most comp gameplay, but that's not why I'm showing it. I want to show y'all the ability you have to shoot with this build. Now, I was only in 97 in this actual gameplay so i was a 97 overall i would have had a 83 three-pointer at the time now i want y'all to see this whole gameplay so y'all can see how i shoot now i streamed yesterday and i was shooting terrible i got all the way done with the stream went to my jump shot and realized i had the wrong jumper on the whole time now it was the same base and everything so you really couldn't tell that much but i had the wrong jump shot on the whole time and that was pretty much why I wasn't shooting good. As soon as I put the jumper back on, I'm shooting good again. But it's the jumper I use with my stretch. It is in my jump shot video. If you want to check that out, feel free. It is the second jump shot I show on there. But I had uh, tried out a different jumper. I just wanted to try some different releases. And I ended up keeping it on on accident. And I had on the wrong jumper. But this release right here, perfect. I love this. This jump shot is very smooth. It helps us build a lot. Now, I want to tell y'all something real quick. Y'all know my pure playmaker. Most of y'all know a lot of subs came from that pure playmaker. This build is like having a pure playmaker, but with Hall of Fame shooting badges. I'm the same height. I have the same defense. I have the same wingspan. The only difference is I can shoot like crazy. I can shoot big greens now. So, a lot of people ask me, which build do you prefer? And I'm going to say every time this build, this is my new favorite build of 2K21. I would not choose any other build over this build right now. I love playing with this. Y'all going to see in a minute what I can really do on the threes when I have floor general as well. Y'all see big greens every time I catch the ball. Now I'm going to miss one jump shot right here and I want y'all to see why. I haven't mastered the moving shots yet. I barely ever take moving shots. So I tried to stop right here, but I accidentally did a moving shot. So I bricked it. It's all good. They get the board. We're about to get it right back. And I'm going to green up some more. But when you have the ability to dribble and move as fast as I do, as well as shoot, look, big greens. He cannot close out in time. I want y'all to see this last play right here. The build is OP. 6'6", can move as fast, can dribble as fast. He can green from anywhere, plus has sharp takeover. Look at this right here, y'all. Now, it's not nothing too nasty, but watch. Watch the shot I take. Spin back in both our face big greens i have nothing else to say let's get right into the next gameplay 
All right, I'm not going to really call these guys comp, but I mean, look what they got. They got 98 play shot, a 97 play shot, and a 85 glass cleaner. This is your typical lineup, something like this. Something where somebody uses screens from the glass cleaner, but I want you to watch how they play. They have the glass cleaner set a screen up top for the guard, and the other guard, he goes corner every time. Now, they play kind of weird, but it actually works out a lot. I want you to see how many threes they get off this. Now, right there, I just slid. I should have had a steal, but I didn't hit square in time. But I want y'all to see how they play. So, they actually were a pretty decent team, even though they play kind of weird. But I want y'all to know something else. I want y'all to know why I like this build so much. For one, I can use screens. I can ISO. I can do it all. Plus... Every single person on this game has a play shot. Now you're gonna see me dex back to the left, get a nice little white to win in. But every single player on this game has a play shot. This is pretty much a play shot, but I put my own twist on it. Now I'm a 6'6 six, six play shot and I get a different name. So that's the reason why I make my builds a little bit different. A whole lot of y'all respect that, y'all like that, and then some people are like, why didn't you just make a play shot, all this other stuff? You know the same typical haters that is always under everybody's comments and everything. But I make my builds to please me, to see what I like to do, big greens. Now you see I'm cooking with my builds, so why are you complaining about it? But I make all my builds to play like I wanna play. I love playing defense. I love shooting threes. I love playmaking. I like doing all that. The only thing that my playmaker couldn't do was shoot consistently all the time. So I made a build that resembles my pure playmaker, but gets Hall of Fame shooting. It's that simple. Now look, big greens again. I'm telling y'all, this build is crazy consistent. I didn't even think I was going to be able to shoot as good as I can. Like I can really pull up from almost anywhere and I only have an 85-3. Something else I want to point out to y'all with Floor General. In this video, I was a 97, but I'm going to talk as if my stats are at 99. So at 99, without floor general, you have an 85 three ball and a 83 ball control. Well, when you have floor general, it adds plus four to both of those. So now I have a 89 three ball and an 87 ball control. So that makes me to where I can momentum off rip. And a 89 three ball, that's green. Not to mention my takeover. As your takeover goes up, you get bonuses to your attributes. I don't know if everybody knows it. Now, of course, when your takeover is fully complete, you get all the bonuses. But even if your takeover goes up to the E, it's giving you a bonus. When it gets full, it gives you a plus five bonus to your attributes that are not resembled by your takeover. So when I get sharpshooting takeover, I get plus five to dunk, plus five to lay up, plus five to all that but I get a plus 10 to my mid range, a plus 10 to my three point shot. Y'all understand where I'm coming from? So I have an 89 three with floor general. When I get my takeover, I have a 99 three, a 99 three. And my build all the way when I get takeover has a 92 ball control. Now, of course you're not gonna have takeover all the time, but sometimes you're gonna get it fast and that's just something y'all need to look into. Cause when you get takeover, you should be helping all those stats. That turns me into a demigod. So, I'm already crazy good, crazy fast, great defense. I'm shooting threes from limitless range. I can do it all. I can hop behind screens. I can ISO. I can dunk. This build is all around just great for me. Like, this is the my dream build, y'all. This is the build that I would use for the rest of 2K21. Now, of course, next gen is going to come out. If current gen was the only thing we had to play, this would be my final build. And I would probably not post very much of anything else. This build is my favorite build by far. Now y'all gonna see what I can really do at the end of the game. Y'all see I've been cooking up. I'm gonna get one more screen. Hey, center, you gotta get out here, coach. I'm gonna get big greens. Y'all gonna lose fast. Now it's 15, 16. Y'all see the offense that they're running. All he does is go to that corner, bro. Now that was a great dot by him. He noticed that we was lacking, dotted the corner extra fast. Y'all see I got takeover though. It's a GG. Now, one thing to make sure y'all never do when y'all take over, do not be selfish. Look at how the offense is being played. They are both guarding me. They're not worried about nobody else on the court except for me. So make sure you always move the ball. That's one of the key things about having takeover is your teammates get open a whole lot more. Now you're gonna see right here, Jordan comes up with a very clutch steal. He pulls up, gets a brick. 
pulls up again, gets a break. Normally he's hitting though, so we ain't even gonna complain. But we just got the ball right back. You know what I gotta do. I got takeover. There's only one choice. Kill him. Who are you jumping at? Big white. It's all good. Cash. And the game is over. Now I appreciate all y'all boys watching the video. I hope y'all was entertained. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Hit that sub button if you're new. And leave a comment if you like the build. Appreciate all y'all watching once again. It's been your boy Wavy. And I'm out. Peace.